All right, everybody, welcome back to the channel. Now, I got a new bike, so I wanted to show everybody what I've got. Um, it's the Giant Stance 1 29er. Um, it's got uh, tubeless tires. It's got a dropper post. Uh, it's got a 1x12, which I really like. It looks like um, SRAM drivetrain. Pretty good. Uh, the brakes are uh, Shimano. And they've been working pretty good. The dropper seat, I'm not sure what that is. Um, now, I did get some stuff that I ordered um, that showed up today that I'm going to be putting on the bike. Now, one thing, there are two things I should say that I want to show you that I already had on the bike. Um, but I didn't film it before. I just didn't get a chance to. Um, I had the Fidlock bottle cage, which it just spins right off and then it snaps right in and all the reviews i've seen have been positive um, so we'll give that a try we'll see how that works i put a padded seat on the one it came with was a lot longer and i'm short so when i came to a stop if i tried to kind of like straddle the bar here um it um it was uncomfortable <laughs> Plus, uh, without the padded seat, my butt was kind of hurting. So, um, I've al I always like padded seat. I got some padded shorts, so that should definitely alleviate a lot of the, the problems. Now, let me show you what I've got here. Um, first thing, I got some valve caps that we're going to put on. Nothing major. Just take a second to put those on. Um, I got some blue ones. I, I like the color blue, so I said, what the hell. Um, and then I got some ergonomic grips. Um, I have basically the same things on my other bike, and I really liked them. I thought they were really comfortable. So I figured I'd order them again, put them on the new bike. Um, now, these were some pedals that I had ordered before. Um, I was going to put them on another bike that I have, but I ended up not doing it. So I just found them and I figure, okay, I'll put them on the new bike. Um, they're blue. Here, let's just open it up real quick. Blue. I like those. Um, I got to get in the other shed to get some grease to put those on. Um, maybe. I don't know. We'll see. When I take these, the other pedals off, these are the pedals off my other bike. They're going to go back on it because it might be going to one of my nieces. I'm not sure yet. Um, I think it'd be a good bike for her. Uh, because I have the tubeless tires, I just got a small uh, tire repair kit. Nothing major. Um, I got to figure out what I'm going to do with that when I'm not riding. Um, I'm trying, I got some new shorts that I'm going to be wearing. I'm trying to make it so I don't have to carry a bag. Uh, but if I do, it could be just possibly like a hip bag or something, something small. Because um, I get that water bottle. And right now I don't go on very long rides, so we'll see how it is. I got some zip ties to, for the cables, just to make sure they're not um, banging around and whatnot. Tie them together. Uh, the cables have internal routing which is good, but there are a couple places that these are held on by zip ties. Um, those are kind of tight. I don't know if I'll take those off somehow. I don't know if they just come off. No, they're zip ties. So I don't want to cut the, the brake line or the shifter line accidentally. Um, they're hydraulic brakes, so I don't want to have to replace that or anything, but I would like to get a little more color on here. It's one thing I might eventually do is see about um, uh, painting the bike, but I'm not sure. Now one thing, and also um, I had a, I got the quad lock mount and phone case, so we'll get that swapped out. Um, now some of this is stuff that I had before, just like a small cheap multi-tool should be good enough and I had a small pump um, I 
don't know. It does come with a mount, but I don't think I really have a place to mount it to is the thing. I could probably finagle something to put it down here. There's no no screws or anything down here to mount anything. Um, that doesn't surprise me. I don't know what this is. I have no idea what that is actually. I might have to see if I can look that up, see if it does anything. Um, and I mean, it's full suspension, rock shocks. Let's see, it says two, 275 mech, that's nothing. Custom tuned for giant. Um, I had bought some tape to put on here, but it looks like they've already got a thing on here. What I think I might do though is still wrap it uh, because I bought some blue tape. Like I said, I wanna get a little bit of color on here. I might eventually try to paint the bike, but we'll see. I don't know yet. Um, and yeah, so I don't know. I might have to, if I want to carry the, sh the pump, I think I'm going to have to uh, carry a bag, at least even just a small bag. Um, I do have one in my truck. Let's take a look here, actually. Uh, is the truck unlocked? It is. I've got a bag here somewhere. My truck's a mess, along with my yard. Uh, this is it. This is it here. It's a small, small bag. Um, nothing major. But... No, that pump I don't think is going to fit in here. No, there's no way. So I probably just won't carry the pump, at least for right now. Because um, like I said, I don't really um, go that far right now. I'm hoping that's going to change soon. Get in better shape, get out for more rides, longer rides. Um, start getting into some harder trails and whatnot. But we will see. All right, so I am going to set up my camera on my, on my uh, bed cover here. Let's see what we can see. Point it down a little ways. Okay, I think that's good. Should be able to see everything. Okay, so first thing we'll do is these valve stems here, or valve cap, I should say, not valve stems. that and this one Just put these other ones back. Now these ones are metal that I put on. I don't know if that makes a difference or not. Uh, so let's go ahead and do these. Um, uh, pedals next. 
I don't know. Is this too big? It is. Know which way? There we go. There's one. All right, let me get in the other shed because I know I have some grease for pedals. Uh, I mean, lights out there. We'll take the phone because the phone can be my flashlight. And because I'm wearing the Mike, you can hear me swearing when I can't find what I need. find it it's actually a little bit easier than I expected it to be <laughs> it's usually never in the first place I look
come on. All right, so we got the grease. This is left. This is gonna be right then. All right, so. Set this down here for a second. Pretty good. Let's do the other side. gonna put this in this shed that way the next time I go looking for it I won't be able to find it until I've been looking for like an hour and then I'll remember oh wait wasn't that uh, in there oops come back here you stinker Oh. <sighs> 
right, pedals are done. Look pretty good, I think. All right, so let's, uh, while we get this, the bike up there, I'm gonna have to take it down to do the handlebars and the quad lock mount. Uh, so what I'm gonna do is we'll do some of these here. Um, I forgot to grab scissors. I'll be back. So this is actually a good test. Um, oh, I forgot scissors. I also forgot the tape for the chain guard. Because um, I'm inside now. So we'll see how good this mic actually works. So, 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 we're going to do various colors, actually. We're going to kind of mix and match them. I want kind of bright colors on the front, actually. So I think we'll use orange, yellow, and pink. Because why not? So, we will start with yellows on each end here. I think putting these, we'll start here. And then we'll go with orange, or actually, let's do both sides here. Whoa! <laughs> Jumped away from me. that and then we'll go with orange on each side actually it looks like I'm only gonna need two on this side um, actually it looks like I'm only gonna need two on each side um, you know what I'm gonna use pink because for my mom she's going through radiation treatment um, to fight cancer. Now her cancer, I'm not saying it's good, but it could be much worse. Um, but because she is going through the treatments and cancer is the one thing I support people on, I don't know if that's the right words or whatever, but, um, but at the same time, it also pisses me off because it's like, I'm, 
like 95% sh sure there is a cure out there for cancer. But there's too much money to be made off treating the disease than curing it. And I just got to give a shout out, fuck cancer. I will not edit that out. That swear word will be staying in there because fuck cancer. Is that... Is that... that... I'll pick that up in just a second. There we go. Um, where did it go? There's a pink one. It's probably right in front of my face. I don't know. I'll find it. Probably next week at some point when I'm mowing. I'll see it. That's all right. All right, so we got those tightened up. So that looks good, I think. And when I take it down, I'll, we'll test spinning the handlebars to make sure they're not stuck or anything. All right, so now, what do we got? We got the quad lock, which I'm gonna need to take down off the, um, the thing. It'll be, uh, just because it'll be a little bit easier to put it on. And the handlebars, the same thing. Um, it'll be easier to reach on the ground. So, let's go ahead and do that. Um, now this, uh, the bike rack I bought on Amazon, I can't remember how much it was. I bought it last year. I love it. Um, I think it's pretty good. Only thing I didn't like about it is it did come with a chain, or not a chain, but a um, cable to be able to lock the bikes down. But the problem is, it's not a very long chain. And I like to be able to put my chain like all the way through, like through the frame, through the tires. Basically, I wanna make somebody, if they're gonna seal it, work for it. I had a cheap long one that, I mean, it kinda of worked, but like I said, it was cheap. So it wouldn't be too hard to cut through. So I bought a new one that works pretty good. Um, it's got a thicker, thicker cable, so they'd have to work a little harder to get to it if they needed to. All right, so let's do the quad lock first. Now, this is an out front mount, but you're supposed to be able to turn it so that the mount would go over the stem, which is what I want to do. So let's see what we got here. Oh. Spacers too? Okay. Oh no, maybe, I'm not sure. Oh, I see, it depends on what you're gonna, um, what you're attaching it to. Okay, cool. So I had a quad lock before, it worked really good. Um, but the thing was that it, um, it was just a, thing held on by a couple um, bands. I mean, it worked. It worked well. I never had any issues with it. All right, so what we're going to do, so this is going to go this way. So let's get this opened. And I think, yeah, you get different sizes, so you have different whatever. So let's put, we'll put this right here. I guess that'll protect the handlebars too, prevent them from getting scratched up, which is good. Uh, let's do a camera check just to make sure we're seeing what we need to see. 
because it's down further. There we go, I think that'll work. You know, look in my ugly shed too. Or not ugly shed, but dirty shed. Okay. And then, ow. <laughs> Damn it, Michael. Oops. I knew I was gonna do that. Um, okay. Let's see if I can find the screw I just dropped. So you know what, let me kind of start getting this back in here. Oops, there we go. We'll tighten it down a little bit. I'm gonna get out the case for the phone. And we can put it on there. That way we can kind of line it up. Now what I'm thinking I wanna do for when I do start doing longer rides some type of pouch or something on here to put a battery an external battery to be able to plug the phone in um, but I don't know how that'll work we'll see I don't know I've been looking I can't really find anything to order that I like um, pull Oh, there we go. Whoops. Ugh. So let's do this. This should just... I always have this trouble. As much as I like this, it can be a pain in the ass to get on there. There we go. All right, so that's good. So let's see. Um, actually, I think that's perfect. I think I like the way that is. Now I got the, um, what's it called? Um, Mag Poncho which I believe allows for wireless charging. Oh no, actually this might go around the phone, the outside of the phone. I'm gonna actually wait till I get inside to put the case on. I don't think you guys need to, need to watch me do that. But I think that's perfect the way it is. So let me go ahead and Screw that in. I'm gonna have to take the case off, but that's okay. I'll get it mostly done. All right, so that's fine. So let's go ahead and take this off. I'll set that there for right now. We'll make sure this is nice and snug. We don't want it moving. It's not going to damage the handlebars. We got that sleeve that came with it. So let's do this. Um, I think I'm going to take these uh, um, reflectors off. I don't think we need them. I don't ride at night. I think they're, I think the bike shop has to sell them with it for whatever reason. Um, I figure out how to take it off. Hmm. I don't know if I can, actually. 
Well, I'm not going to worry about it. It's not going to hurt anything for them to be on there. Um, okay, so handlebars, or not handle, yeah, well, grips, whatever you want to call them. Um, so let's actually, let's grab this here. And put this back in the case with the instructions. Not that I need them, but we'll see. Actually, it's a mag case, but I think it has to have, there's something that goes on there, but I'm not sure. Um, if it comes with it or not. I'll have to read the instructions. It's a compatible, MagSafe compatible case. So we'll have to see. All right, so now, does this just come off? It's already partially broken off. Hmm. I don't remember running into anything, but that doesn't mean anything. Um. and cap. I know there are other ways to, probably better ways to remove these, but you know what? These aren't going to get used again, they're cheap.
scratch the handlebars. Well, they're already scratched a little bit. Perfect. Do one at a time. <laughs> now I'll put, um, a link to everything I bought in the description. I don't know if it matters which side these go in. No, nope. now this sits. I don't think it really matters with these either. So let's see, I might have to adjust, um, move the, the brake lever and the shifter over, but I'm not sure yet. So. I'm dropping everything today. Get the wrong size. God damn it. I hope not. All right, I gotta run inside for a minute. So I'm gonna pause recording. And I will be right back. All right, I just restarted it. Stopped recording for a second for some reason. I don't know why. Uh, voice commands are off, I think. Let's find out. GoPro, stop recording. Yeah. Huh. I don't know. I didn't even say anything that I thought would cause it to shut up or shut down or whatever. Yeah, like I said, I'm going to have to adjust the, the brake and the 
um, the shifter are both going to have to move over a little bit at least. So let's get these loosened up. size I'm turning it the wrong goddamn way. I am the not so ace spice bike mechanic. Do not hire me to work on your bike because I will fuck it up. Alright, so I think I need a little bit up. Yeah, I think right there is going to be good. I'll know for sure when I ride it, but I think that's that's pretty good, right where that is. So this here, grab this here. again actually you know what because I'm only supposed to use one finger but then that sticks way out what if we sw can we swap them I don't see why not I don't know no, I'm going to have to, for right now,
caps. It'd be easier. Scissors go.
right. This fits it. Then it's too big. But does the Allen wrench? Does this fit? We're almost done. Just gotta get this handlebar on. And I keep saying handlebar, I mean uh, grips. <laughs> Trying to lose light. Time it. Oh, it's after eight. I didn't realize that.
All right, I think we are done. Um, except for the phone case, I'll do that inside. Uh, I don't know if I'm gonna record that or not. I don't see real need to. I'll show it to you when I do the first ride. Um, so let me get stuff picked up. Some of the stuff is trash. Some of it we're gonna hold on to for, oh, excuse me, just in case. I'll take the Fidlock bottle inside. Okay, let's get, oh, I know what I didn't do. I didn't do the chain guard with the tape. Do I want to? Yes, I do. So we're gonna put the bike back up on the, on the stand, well, not on the stand, but on the um, thing here. And I just gotta turn it around. Oh, that might have to come up a little bit. I don't know, we'll know when I ride it the first time. Um, I'm looking, you can't see it on the camera because I moved the bike, but the grip, the right one is a little bit lower than I want it to be. And the shifter might need to be turned just a little bit. Okay, you know what, let's, uh, do this. I'm going to turn the camera a little bit just to look at the yard. I'm going to ride the bike around a little bit. I still got to put the tape on the chain stay, but that won't take but a couple minutes. But let me just ride the bike around the yard for a second. Ugh. I guess that's all right. Pedals feel good. Um, this is a test again of the microphone too. I gotta practice getting out of the saddle more, especially on uphills. All right, good. Good, 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 good. Everything feels good. All right, so let's uh, do this. Super tight. All right, so we're gonna tape this up. We're gonna leave this on it. Um, Actually, I don't want to leave that on it. Yeah, what the hell? Extra protection. That's what she said. Ooh, wait a minute. <laughs> All right, so let's see. We get this to work. Well, 
not taking the tire off. Maybe I won't do this. At least not right now. do what we've done. We're going to try one more thing. And if it doesn't work, it doesn't work. Oops, I got the camera pointed the wrong way. You're not even watching what I'm doing. All right, let's start recording again. I don't know what happened. But what I did, the, um, the roll of tape doesn't want to fit even with me squishing it down. So it's kind of bundling up and whatnot. So what I'm going to do, what did I do with the tape? Oh, I put it up there. What did I do with the scissors? I put them right there. So what we're gonna do, let's tear off a hunk. Now, there's already a protector on here. I don't really need to do this, but I want a little color. too long.
That'll be good enough for right now. I'll probably put another layer on at some point, but not right now. It's getting late. All right, let's get stuff picked up. And then head inside. I think I just killed a mosquito that was eating me. All right, so I'm gonna put these pedals in here. They gotta go back on the other bike. And let's see what we got here. All right, so. Mm -hmm. We'll put the valves, valve caps in there just for the hell of it. All right, so this goes inside, this goes inside. All right, so I am going to put this and this in here for right now. This will stay in the truck. So, even if I decide not to wear it, I can still take it with me. Because, like I said, it's going to stay in the truck. And this is the box for the pedals. I don't think we'll need that anymore. Um, we won't need that anymore. We don't really need... Actually, you know what? We're going to put this in here. So I haven't had to plug anything yet. Any holes on the tires. Hopefully I won't ever have to. But you never know. Alright, so let me... Uh, anything else? I get the multi-tool, so I don't need Allen wrenches. You know what? Let me put the tape in here. You know, you never know. Tape might come in useful for something. Um, I got the quad lock, so I won't need to put my phone in here. That'll save me a little bit of weight. Um... This stuff here is trash. All right, so let's put all the trash together here. Let's put, these will go inside. We'll put those on there for right now. That's going inside. All right, let me put this back in the truck. <laughs> use this. I don't know how good it really is. Um, it's got air going in. So I don't know. Um, no. It would have to go on there. I don't want to put it here because I just barely clear the top bar as it is. And I'm not sure. No. Maybe. Zip tie it on. Um. I don't want it rubbing on the tire. What if we put it on here? Think that would work? No, I don't like the idea of that. I don't want to fuck with the, the fork. I don't want anything to go wrong. Um, no, because I'd have to wrap it around the whole thing. Uh, I guess it's not going on the bike. So what I think I'll do, I'm going to order one more thing. Uh, 
Um, they have the CO2 cartridges and uh, adapter. You just pop it in there, put it on here, and it fills it right up. And that can go in the bag. But they do have ones that kind of hide either in the stem, I don't want to have to do that, or in the handlebar. Kind of on the end tube here. That might work. I'll have to, um, we'll do a little research, see what we can find. I don't need it right this second. But um, I love this, this water bottle. It shrunk back down, so I just won't put ice in it. I'll have to get like a bag of ice or something. Ah. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm gonna take this back inside though. All right. Set that there. Got a bunch of stuff going back in. I may have to make a couple trips. But let's put the bike away first. Alright, so let's do this here. I don't know if I pointed out um, the GoPro mount for the back of the bike. I meant to bring it out, actually, my GoPro 9, and test it. But just looking at it, I can tell there's plenty of clearance between the tire and this here. Um, actually, let me put the seat down now that I think about it. Um, Have to ride around for a second here. We <laughs> I'm gonna build a ramp. It's a small, tiny thing. Practice jumping. That might be next year. All right. So let me see. Now, with the seat down. Um. Yeah, it's back enough. I think we'll be all right. I do have a metal case for it, so I gotta see. Um, I am filming with my GoPro 11, um, Hero 11 Black. Um, I'm using the external battery. It's been going all right for a couple, for some reason it shut down a couple times. Or not shut down, but it stopped recording. So when I get inside, I'm gonna take it out of the case to see how hot it is. And we'll see what's going on. Hopefully I don't have any issues recording rides. So we'll see.
All right, nothing else has to go in here. At least not right now. Okay, that was weird. Said it was repairing the file. It doesn't say anything about overheating or anything. So I'm not sure what's going on. Like I said, when I get inside, I gotta take it out of the case and we'll see what happens. Um, but we'll go there from there. I'm done for tonight, so I just gotta clean up. Um, I'm gonna put the case for the phone on. I'll do that inside. I'm not gonna record it. Um, but we'll go from there. All right, I will see everybody out on the trails.